Seems your special agent has special needs. Trying to drown his sins and sorrows. Talk to Songbird via the relic. We can communicate again. Hmm. All good there, Reed? Yeah. I just need to process for a minute. It's just how I'm built. A little adversity and I need a few moments to think. Come up with anything? Yeah. We now know who took a swipe of Myers's head. What are you thinking? I don't know about you, but I see coincidences as patterns. Structures we have yet to recognize. Huh. What you driving at? SF-1 crashes. Not anywhere, but over specific turf. Controlled by someone who found some obscure forgotten tech in a secret bunker. Right. Crash was an inside job. We suspected that from the get-go. Now we know it was. And we know it was Songbird. She was behind it. Too early for conclusions, don't you think? Got no proof she planned this in advance. Could have improvised. Reacted to facts. Come on. You don't actually think she learned about the cure just now? She made a deal with Hanson earlier. Had to. Before any of this went down. Traded the president's life for access to the tech. The NUS press sold to a crime lord. Huge. If true. Maya's pressured Somi to reach further, breach boundaries. And then Somi snapped. I don't know about that. Song recruited me specifically to pull Myers out of that wreck. I seriously doubt she wanted her dead or snatched by Hanson. It's never that simple, V. As I see it, Somi was playing both sides, simultaneously spinning deals with Hanson and you. She has Hanson set, then you come in. She contacts you via the relic, asks you to rescue the president. Absolution for her right there. You need to cure just as much, guaranteeing you'll help if her plan falls through. And here we are. Yeah, and here we are, rushing to Songbird's rescue. Thinking a few steps ahead was always her strength. But judgment calls and situational assessment, her Achilles heel. As a chess master, she'd be famous for dazzling plays and excruciatingly beautiful defeats. Still trust her. Trust she'll keep her word. Promise me the cure, and I fully intend to get it. Only thing that matters, really. I'd be careful. Mind sharp. Eyes and ears attuned. But I know Somi well enough to know she'll do her damnedest to be fair. So, what are you thinking about all this? I'm not convinced Somi's to blame for everything. In this trade, nothing's ever as it seems. You gotta keep asking questions till you get to the bottom of it. That's experience talking. Main thing now is to get her out of this cesspool of a sitch. Then we'll see which direction to take. Right. Still should watch her every move closely. Sure. Unconditional trust? No more. Out the window. Right. Back to the sitch at hand. What do we have to do to save her? To grab the tech Songbird and I both need, we gotta go to a meet with Hanson. Prep for it's required. Cause we show up as a pair of runners. Need to collect their identities first. Whatever that means. Personality imprint theft. Sounds like our Colombian job of yore. Who are they and where do we find them? So how's one go about it? Clubbing someone's personality? FIA Menanthropic Tech. Alex has access. You seem to use it already. You look, sound, and act like the individual whose personality you assume. To do it, we need scans of our targets. Song got this shard to me. Take a look. Our targets are a brother and sister, red-haired twins. They're here somewhere, schmoozing. Hmm. Okay, we need to pull data. Get samples of assorted behavior. We make contact with them, talk, Scan as we talk. Got it. I think. So, time to make our move? 
Over there. Wow. Traced them to Flash, Reed. Noticed them some time ago. They stand out even in this mountain pot. Twin roulette, looks like. Alex, you copy that? Radio loud and clear. Prep and scan tech now. You're new to this, but relax. We'll do it as a four-hander. I scan one, you handle the other. Alex will pilot us through. V, zip and funds your way from our operating budget. Load up on chips and join their game. Just don't go all in from the get-go. We stagger our approach, and we're strangers. Let's get to this. Struck gold with roulette, really. Gambling throws people around, high and low, brings the joy of winning and the despair of defeat. Perfect for our purposes. Greetings, madam. Wanna buy some chips? Of course. Good luck at the tables. V, important. You're not there to have fun. Simple bets, red or black only. None of the double street or basket bullshit, understood? Understood. 32. Will you join us? Even. Red. Place your bets, please. Betting's open? By all means. Black it is, then. Relax. Lime drinks, break the ice. I'll join you momentarily. All bets are in. Betting is closed. What? No introduction? V. You? Aurore Cassel. And that boar is my brother, Emmerich. What's your poison? My treat. A bourbon for me. Alas, mon frère does not drink. You heard the lady. And real water for the gentleman here. And what'll you have? Same as the lady. Bourbon coming up. Your drinks will be here shortly. 34. Even. Et merde! Place your bets, please. Good. V. Can't get a hold of Reed. No idea where he is. Stall for time, okay? Hmm, I just realized. Uh, you must have dirt beneath your fingernails too. Like all these bastards and bitches. That is, unless you're uh, in tourist. Like the no-lifers who must watch others live to feel anything. Provocative. What do you think I am? Oh, my, my! One drink and already flirting? Bold. Sixteen. Even. Red. Ah, oh, yes! Ah! Fucking done here! Duh! <sighs> Place your bets, please. Can't help feeling I, uh, interrupted something when I walked up. Do not worry yourself about this. Oh, come, come. V is just being cordial. N'est-ce pas, V? You weren't snooping just now, were you? Odd. Red. Still no sign from Reed, V. Got a sinking feeling about this. Place your bets, please. Eight's my magic number, so gonna go with eight. Sure wasn't snooping. No, just being plain courteous. Oh, don't be such a bore. I simply don't like bores. Of course you were snooping, as we are simply too interesting to ignore. Listen, Reed's MIA for now. Can't wait for him. Gotta do both scans on your own. We were discussing local politics, specifically our host, Monsieur Kurt Hansen. Big fish selling big guns for big money. Yet here you have celebrities, politicians, even the chief of police. 
So I was thinking, uh, perhaps Hansen would do better by being a veritable businessman, no? I claim he would. Mon cher frère disagrees. Nine. Odd. Red. Ugh. Guess it's not my lucky day. Place your bets, please. Who is Kurt Hansen really? A crucial question. Tread carefully with that duo, V. Certainly not liable to become a taxpaying, law abiding night citizen. Kickbacks to NC officials. Are they not taxes, not protection money? Doing business carries a price. Dogtown needs Night City to prosper. Hansen needs it. Une diversification of profit centers makes sense. I myself have a small firm in Paris. My stand in takes calls, arranges meetings, and deflects, deflects, deflects. Why would he need that? Hansen! Uh, providing weapons to banana republics is not quite a sure and stable business. 28. Even. Black. Place your bets, please. Tu ne serais pas en train de devenir trop pote avec elle. Oh, fais pas ton jaloux, petit frère. C'est pas comme si on allait baiser, elle et moi. Charming little show you're putting on. <gasps> you see, Amrik, we are charming. I mean, Hansen could take Dog down by the throat, eject the junkies, and make it a paradise for billionaires. Just getting rich is dull. You should work for the community, invest, create jobs, throw banquettes. She's getting chatty. Doing good, V. And charities are excellent washing machines. You launder billions, believe me. 29. Odd. Black. Place your bets, please. You're so childish. It's beautiful. What? Hansen going missionary position in business? Nonsense. <sighs> Reed's still not responding. But you keep working it. Let's go. Swap twins. Naive thinking, friend. You wearing digiblinders? Excuse me? For fuck's sake, V. No offense, but you're claiming there's no point in Hansen going legal. He's making great scratch as a criminal. Yes? And? Meaning... Sure, he can stay in his comfort zone, churn out eddies. Or, with a bit of legwork, become an untouchable gazillionaire. Tons of hustlers, plain criminals out there don suits. Fuckers are truly above the law now. Wow, just opened them up. Nice. Seven. Odd. Red. Oh, putain! Place your bets, please. Don't got much respect for upright, honest peeps, do you? Allow me to say, V. Arms or property, it would make no difference to me what I sell. And to spend five years on efforts to uh, change how people see you, call you. To be upstanding in the eyes of others. I could not give a shit. Pretty, even, black. Place your bets, please. Getting there. Almost got it. Give me something big now. Make them laugh or cry, I don't care. Like the tingle of risk? Oh, ma vieille, t'as pas d'idée. Thinking we can add a little spice to our game. I'm listening. My, my, I too, I'm curious. How about we go all in? Bet everything we won tonight. And we play different colors, yes? You win or we do. And either you or we lose all. My thoughts exactly. A moment. You join the table, buy drinks, talk and talk. Now you wish to risk everything? I find this disquieting. Perhaps you could now tell us about yourself. Tread Name's V. Afterlife affiliated. Make what you will of it. Oh, are you happy now? You choose first, then. 
I'm seeing red coming. Black for us, then. Leave us for a moment, if you please. Congratulations to you. I know your friend Reed is FIA. My natural assumption is, you're an agent too. I'm also guessing you two took it upon yourselves to save the President, then exfil her out of Dogtown. I should send you back to Night City in body bags, filled with pieces. You trying to scare me? Dunno. Are you afraid? We're just talking, aren't we? Wow, you cracked it. Clever man. To be honest, I got tired of the media circus. All the allegations thrown in my face, the bullshit propaganda. Luckily, we can put all that behind us now. Oh, so you couldn't be happier we saved Myers after your botched hit. Right. Think you believe that less than I do. I will let you and Reed walk free of this place. In one piece. On your own two feet. Consider it a gesture of my goodwill. Your little bird came to me on her own, though. She was tired of breaking international laws on the President's whim. She simply had to run away. Breaching the Black Wall, jeopardizing the net, all humankind's safety, in fact, for personal gain? I wonder what Netwatch would say. Pass it on to President Myers. Also tell her, her toy of mass destruction is my friend now. And she should get the fuck out of my backyard, or the world will learn about her games. I've matters to attend to. You'll find Mr. Reed downstairs. Okay, V. Got all we need. Sheesh. Colossal prick. Hear what he said? Yeah, caught it all. Didn't like it one bit, either. Son of a bitch that I'd find Reed downstairs. Yeah, heard him. Wasn't crazy about his tone. Time to evac, V. Best not tempt the fates. Head to the elevator, ride down to one. Need to know what's up with Saul. You're going to eat something, Lizzy. No buts. You can't run on empty forever. <laughs> Let it go, Avi. I'm a firecracker on an empty stomach. You know that. <laughs> and the night is young. Hey there, Lizzy. V, what are you doing here? Could legitimately ask you the same. <laughs> yeah. I might be a little out of place, but I get around. And dog tag. Well, it always gets me wet. Fortunately, I have darling Avi here. Avi's my new bodyguard. The best I've ever had, if a little too overprotective. Pleasure, Avi. Headset's Nova, Lizzie. <laughs> like it? Here, it's yours then. For real? Sure, got loads of them. You'll look like you're on Team Wiz Wiz. It's liable to take you places. I want you to have it. Wow. Thanks, Lizzie. Next release? Planned? Maybe in the works already? Kinda. For now, though, I'm obsessed with galaxies, nebulae, and sea turtles. Uh-huh. Care to elaborate? 
<laughs> See, with that you know more than my producer. Patience, please. You'll just have to wait. Looking like you're about to delta out of here. Making my exit soon, yeah. But from one party on to another. A tomb of mine from Legos is throwing one on his yacht. Friends, fireworks, diving, a private fashion show. Hmm, shame. Some R&R &R out on the water would do But I'm sure you're, like, super busy. Plus, knowing him, there's gonna be drama, so I'm totally sparing you. Totally. Thanks. Hey, how are you holding up? Last time we saw each other was, you know. I'm doing great. Really inspired me. Never felt better. Yeah. Never felt better. Hope it stays that way. Enjoy your evening, Lizzie. Take care, V. And you keep skating along that edge. So fun. I'll be ready to bug out of here in five. Yeah, I see your invitation, man. Oh, sure. Is everything all done? No need to worry. Routine verification. Please enjoy your evening. Yo, oh, Wendy o Williams. Toughest ass rocker girl ever. Took her own life when I was nine. Were she here, she'd fucking burn the stage down. Blow everyone and everything up to high heaven. And I need to know this because... I'd give all the parties I ever went to, including this one, to see her live and in concert just once. That's why. Now let's delta the fuck out of here while you still got the chance. Actually, the laundry room area, I think someone was there. But earlier. Come on. Sure. Thinking about what that prick said. Guy knows. Got some dirt on Myers. Can't imagine it happening. But if the public learns that any U.S. president willingly broke international laws governing cyberspace use... The USA is fucked. Myers will either have to take the fall, let herself be buried in dirt for this, or she'll defy the world and spark another war. Fuck me. Songbirds are walking to the end of the end. And Hansen's got her on a tight leash. And he can prime her for use whenever he wants. Listen, V, we need to get her out. For everyone's sake. Oh, just once I'd like to see things go smoothly, as planned. This feels so very, very wrong. You and your tomb best be headed the fuck out now. Straight on from here. Gonna walk you two out. Come on, V. No reason to hang. Reed. Not the time, V. Think you can stand there and bark orders at me? Fuck the fuck off! Um, I mean, um, please make your way to the exit. Leaving already? How was the party? You have a good time? Norm will be out in moments. Good girl! No stopping, let's go. Fuck off. Follow me. How'd things go, V? Got everything. All set. You got thorough scans of the runners. Both of them. Yourself. I said, we got everything. Well, well. And then you, uh, excused yourself. Stepped away. Disappeared. How could you spill where you been? What happened? Had us worried. The op was underway. I didn't want to jeopardize it, so... When confronted, 
I behaved. They cornered me, got me before we could meet up. Forget the rest. How'd it go at the table? Anything to worry about? Hansen showed up, we chatted, threats were made, actually. Said if Myers doesn't let up, we're all to learn about Songbird, about Pierce and the Blackwall. He clearly knows what Somi means to the President. Personal WMD, you mean? Yeah, Hansen knows all. Need to get her the fuck out, Reed. Really? I was afraid of this. Okay. P, Alex and I have work. We need to analyze the data from Songbird. Might take a day or two. Prem, open comms line then? Sure. We'll work out a game plan. Get back to you ASAP. Oh, and V, bang up work. Ready to meet me at Alex's. Sure. See you there. Been here before, Reed. You have to let go. Remember last time we had this convo? I do. Ah, V, you're here. About time, too. Nearly done finalizing the plan. Back on the same page, are we? Not exactly. Brings back a lot of memories, all this. One in particular sticks out. Before NC, we worked in Op in Colombia. Medellin. Song's Not first now, mission. Alex. We have enough to do without digging up ancient history. What happened in Medellin? What was the up there? We had our sides trained on a guy who sat on the Colombian president's back pocket. Sold him smuggled corp tech. You saying the FIA pulls strings overseas? A lot of what we do doesn't get printed in the norm sheets. Anyway, we used stolen identities on that mission too. Things didn't go exactly as planned, but that's... a long story. Think we can spare 60 seconds? Hell, might even learn something about So Me that'll prove useful. All right. Our person of interest was one Luis Hernandez, arms trading heavyweight. We aim to plant our own SA in his organization. Alex had adopted the identity of an engineer from Hernandez's entourage. She was our ticket in. She walks in to attend a meeting one day. She sees one of Luis's bikini model girlfriends prancing out on her way to walk his dopamine. Spending big money on Kit's luxury it was kind of his M.O. So, what happened? Well, Somi had put together Hernandez's dossier. Problem was, an important detail slipped through the cracks. The engineer's abject fear of dogs. Cold sweat, shaky hands, soggy pant leg, that kind of fear. When the Doberman sniffed Alex's knee, she pats him on the head and says, Who's a good boy? Then, she went to pull up a chair at Hernandez's table. Before she could sit down, they had two barrels to her head and one trained at the base of a spine. What did you do? Well, my hands are bound, got a sack on my head, hear a collapsible baton snap into place, flack. I did what anyone do in that sitch. I lied my fucking ass off. Don't sit quite straight to this day, though. Okay, back to Night City, folks. With our sights trained on a new target. Parse the intel from the shard Somi gave us. It's a solid foundation for the mission we want to run. Surveillance, recon, data gathering, planning, it's all done. It's high time we... righted some wrongs of the past. Fuck off, Reed. Give it a rest, will ya? Nothing here's your fault. Woman's an adult, made her own decisions. Consequences caught no, up to her. No, she was manipulated. There was no one around who could have had her back. Here, V. Mission details on this. Alex nailed it. 
If anyone's to blame, it's Myers, not you. You might be right, but so am I. Right, our objective, to free Somi from under Hans's duress. Unfortunately, this ain't a normal rescue op, because... Well, she's been infected with something from beyond the Black Wall. A consequence of her service to the NUS and President Myers. I'm not about to pretend I understand the tech wise and how. The important thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, it'll kill her. The cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. So this neural matrix, how much do we know? Experimental tech nested in a mainframe that someone dragged up from deep beneath Dogtown. From a bunker, to be exact. Part of Project Sinusure, a joint U.S. Militech operation mounted in a bid to counter our Osaka soul killer. The Matrix itself is a functional container. It houses an AI from beyond the Black Wall, and its design lets the user deploy the AI for a specific purpose. In our case, to fix you and Songbird. All right. Glenn, let me hear it. Hanson to meet with the Netrunners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close. To Song and the Matrix. Hanson hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. They know its security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hanson access codes. Handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hanson's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural matrix is in there, too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals we have. Now we just need to take those twins out of the equation. Hey, Marik and Aurora Cassell. We know anything more beyond what we saw firsthand. Yep. Songbird put together full profiles for both. Super short brief. They got their start at Militech and dove in deep. That is, till they learn the pay's better on the dark side. I buy that. Sure didn't hide their love of Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss that next paycheck, cause they ran into us. We're gonna nab them before they reach Hansen. So we kidnap them. How we wanna do this? They're driving a rental while in NT. An exploitable opening. We're gonna track their ride and hijack it. Before they reach Hansen at the stadium. That's where you come in, V. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Addicts will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavioral imprints are tuned already. And your role in all this, Reed? I'm drawing up your exfil route. Once you complete the mission, you need to get out in a hurry. I'll provide transport, make sure the path's clear and problem-free. Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hanson? Right. Where well, you'll sell him the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, Key to unlock in your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hansen's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hansen. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. Gonna disarm Hansen, take him and his guards out. Hansen and his goons. Aim to handle them on your own? You can do a lot more than play dress up, thank you. Plus, element of total surprise in my corner. Still, sweet of you to worry. Sounds like Flatline and Hansen set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at the state. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the NUS. And Songbird? We have to rescue her. Myers told you as much as self. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. How much have you told Myers? What's she know? That Somi's fallen into the hands of the man who's organized the downing of Space Force One. Is that all? All for now. Main goal, want to make sure I'm clear. We're springing Songbird free from Hansen's iron grip. And seizing tech that's gonna save your lives. You and Alex enter the stadium as Hansen's visiting Netrunners. Disguises our key to the op. First step. What was it again? Securing a trace on the Netrunner's car. This bit's on you. Alex will expand on that in a minute. Meanwhile, we'll make sure the personality data and imprints are airtight. 
Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. So, time we talked about Nab and the Runners? Cover that in a minute. You know Reed better than I do, what he thinks. What's his true aim here? Saving so me or carrying out a mission? Saul imagines he's responsible for her, always has. Thinks he's responsible for all of us. Hell, even for you, I bet. It's how he keeps his grip on reality, life. With mixed results, mind you. <laughs> and so me? Same story as always. Dares, lends neck deep in shit, somehow crawls out. Rinse and repeat. Myers doesn't know the deeds of this op, does she? Never will. Is that right? It's not wrong. So, we serve Hansen up on a silver platter. It'll be salutes and handshakes. Shit goes sideways. We're royally fucked. Welcome to the Agency. And any for your thoughts, Alex? About all this? <sighs> Honestly? Still wondering why neither of us went back to DC. Not me, not Reed. They put him to sleep. Saddled you with the Dogtown assignment. Who are you kidding? Say we disobeyed orders, gone back. A dressing down by some bureaucrat would be the worst we'd have had to endure. Think... Think we were both waiting for something. Like, the downing of Space Force One. Probably makes us a sad fucking pair of hypocrites. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those? We find the car easy. There's a station not far. Near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. Stations. How do they work exactly? They ping vehicle IDs across the network. Monitor location, tire pressure, all of that. Hack them, and it'll be open season on the runners. Find it hard to believe taking one station will be enough. Rental agency's got rare rides to protect. Hmm. See if I can find more info. If the one's not enough, we'll improvise. So breach the station, trace the car. Good, what then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. Dunno. If anything goes wrong, I'll be stuck in there. Suck it up. This is FIA trunk ops, soldier. <laughs> Seriously, though, the tech just works. And we'll have your back the whole way. Sounds simple enough. Tech worth tens of thousands can help any plan go off like a dream. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it. Great. Just great. I ain't got a problem, Alex. Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. Think we're good with just one more? <laughs> it's a car rental company, for Christ's sake. How sophisticated a system can they have? Hold on, let me ping the station remotely. Try to save us some time. Clever. Good luck out there. And raise Reed as soon as you grab that encryption key.
You made it. Got a head start. A drink to calm the nerves. Appreciate the invite. Glad to see you, Alex. Sweet of you to say. I wrote you because... because I needed someone to talk to. Someone outside the firm. And not some total rando. To take my mind off the mission, not worry about being someone else for a millisec. Hope that makes sense. Okay. So, what do you want to talk about? I mean, it's not like I have an agenda typed up. I just want... to be a normal fucking person for a little bit. Myself, specifically. Just me. Just Alex. Starting to make a lot more sense why retirement was your condition to accept the mission. Guess you'd call it burnout. Or maybe just the need for anything resembling normal. If I even know what that is anymore. Say, you ever think about who you'd be now? If, you know, life had taken a different turn? Head of our Osaka counterintel in NC. My old boss would probably be dead by now. Me sitting at his desk. A nice corner office with a view of Corpo Plaza. And the feeling that it all belongs to you. That you're in control. Sounds fucking wretched. Yeah. To your health. Okay, now you. Who would you be, if not a secret agent and master of disguise? An actor. No hesitation there. Always dreamed of seeing my face on a show bill. I love musicals, especially. Seriously? <laughs> Call me old-fashioned. So yeah, guess I'd be a brain dance star. Hmm. <laughs> What's so special about musicals? The world in song is much more beautiful than in reality. Intensely so. Plus, I just like to dance. To your future career. I know you can pull it off. Thanks, V. Really. I love this song! Don't do this often, I'm guessing. Busted moves? I can't say I do. What gave it away? <laughs> Wasn't thinking of dancing, but never mind. See you on BD posters in no time. I know it. First, retirement. Attention, this is Good news, 
See you soon, V. V, heads up. I can't talk long, but two things, quickly. First, good news. I managed to upgrade your relics firmware. You'll see what I mean in a minute. Don't worry, completely painless. Relic upgraded? How'd you manage it? No easy feat, I'd guess, tweaking tech that advanced. Mm, let's say I've had extra time on my hands. More than I expected. Don't worry. We're getting you out of there. I know. First good news, you said. So there's a second thing? Right. It's... super important. It stays between us. It's gotta. Proof of my trust. I'm sending you coordinates. Come after dark. We should be able to talk freely. Okay, need to Delta. We'll see you soon. Sure we're alone? Wouldn't want any unpleasant surprises. No surprises. Except maybe you're already one of us. Don't trust a soul. This spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Wanted to show you something. It means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in NC on assignment. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills. Crack open beers. Talk about nothing in particular. I'd swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it. Every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn. Actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it. Brooklyn. Hmm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape. Just lit a J. Down on the street, I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasting funk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scop dogs around. He shit talking one of his chews. And there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. Yearning in to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you miss something, it's usually too late. Songbird, need you to be straight with me. I... I helped Hanson spring the trap on Myers. Maya did the deal in exchange for the neural matrix. I down the plane, deliver Myers, yes. But blast her out of the sky, then hunt her down? Wasn't what we agreed. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself, too, almost. Ground the plane. That was a plan. Didn't expect he... Blow it to shit. Not much of an excuse, I know. So what was your plan? 
for you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI matrix, and for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. It fucked everything up. I know, V. But I had no choice. Still don't understand why. Was it any other way? Honestly? Wouldn't have resorted to this, if there was. From Myers, the NUSA, um, just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. And weapons and tools, they don't get to make decisions or choose to retire. Sounds... Sounds painfully familiar. Think I know how you feel? I doubt anyone understands this feeling as well as you do, V. You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, you feel the same way about me? Don't trust Reed? Guy wants to save your life. Mm-hmm. He saved me once already. Word of a boss shit on Militech crossed his desk, so he knocked on a 19-year-old girl's door with an offer she couldn't refuse. Join and serve, or become a Netwatch trophy. That girl died that day. The person in front of you is what was born from that death. Of course, Reed, he died too. Just more recently, seven years ago. The NUS issued his death sentence, yet he serves the country to this day, clinging to something that's lost all meaning to me. Been one to ask, actually. What happens exactly, you know, when you reach past the Black Wall? Now the feeling when you try to remember the address of a place you lived half your life, but it just turns up blank. I mean, losing your memory? A snowflake lands on my glove. I can calculate its unique fractal structure. But what did my mom's voice sound like? Sometimes I, I lose control. Or get the sense I'm surrendering to someone else. But it feels horrible. Felt it too. With the chimera. Like a live-in nightmare. Yeah. More and more, I get the sense someone's standing behind me. But there's never anyone there. Why not just go home? My home burned down when I was forced to trade warm Brooklyn brick for sterile Washington walls. I have nowhere to go back to. Get the feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah. With you, and myself. I need to get away. From Kurt, the NUSA, Reed. From everything. Speaking of, out of everybody out there, you saw Hansen as a trusty ally. Seriously? I needed someone who could tear me from Meyer's grip. I knew him from my time in Night City, when I was posted here. Took a steep risk, all right. And a plain gonk one at that. That's why I enlisted you, too. Night City is just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... Things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved. Or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, V. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... You know how it is. 
How am I to know this isn't an elaborate con? I mean, I have some kind of guarantee. I can't give you one, sorry. But I've shown you my trust. I mean, you're free to sell me out to Reed, right? Or trust me enough to save us both. No guarantee for either of us. Fair deal, I say. Okay. Say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission, grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. And then... You help me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the Matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And... that's it. Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me, or because I promised to save your life? Can't be both. You'd fit right in in DC. Just enough truth, but not too much. I'll take what I can get. <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hansen. Status report. Reed, hey. I'm Nova, thanks. How are you? Put a cold beer in front of me once this is all over. Then we'll have time to chat. For now, fill me in on what you managed to get done. So me contacted me. Got news. Let me hear it. Well, first off, we've been greenlit. Our VIP's ready to be served. Music to my ears. What else? Songbird opened up a bit. Better sitch. It's... looking bad. Real bad. This tech's her only shot. I hear you. I do. All the more reason to focus on the mission in front of us. Get our hands on that cure. But Reed, what Somi spilled, we really need to talk. I know, but later. Not a topic for the hollow. V, one other thing. You need new chrome. An implant that accommodates behavioral imprints. I'm sending you deets for a clinic. The doc will be expecting you. Just tell the Ripper you know she collects unification war trinkets. She'll know you came with my blessing. 